friends welcome back my look fantastic box has arrived yay i'm all excited but before we bust this beautiful pink box open if you're new here hello my name is amy hit the subscribe button before you leave and come and join our youtube family we are a lovely bunch with that being said pop the kettle on pull up a chair and let's dive into this box this is an absolute stunning color i like this i'm not a pink kind of lady i do like blue but i like this i have a 12 month rolling subscription with look fantastic look fantastic is a beauty website and they also provide a monthly beauty subscription box i will put the details in the description box below on you know how much i pay for my subscription and all that kind of stuff because i just want to dive into this beautiful box now as per usual we get the edit which is a really nice magazine it will tell you all about the products kind of how to use them a few tips and tricks which is great you get a sneaky peek which I'm going to show you in a second and there's also a few like hidden extras in the magazine it's well worth a read pop your feet up in the bath with a cup of tea and have a good read now I'm going to show you the sneaky peek for last month so if you don't want to see it close your eyes but I'm going to tell you it's worth £18.66 and I've not used this product before so I'm looking forward to it so close your eyes now there we go it looks cool I quite like that and like I said I've not used this brand before I will be referring to the magazine as you can guarantee there's certain products in here that I've probably not used not heard of the brands which is cool because I really like using new things now I apologise for the noise as uh, these boxes can be quite noisy and I also apologise for the noise that you may be able to hear going on outside someone is renovating their garden <laughs> so there's been banging and goodness knows what going on so the first item I'm going to show you is the sneaky peek from last month and it's the Avant Pink or Orchid Hyaluronic Glycerin White Peony Overnight Serum and there we go now if you've been with me for a while you will know I have a love-hate relationship with the brand Avant I love to hate it <laughs> no, I'm joking <laughs> it, it's just that all of the products that I've tried are jam-packed with hyaluronic acid and hyaluronic acid just doesn't suit my skin I can tolerate in very small doses but not in kind of you know large quantities or you know quite high concentrates so I'm gonna give it a go I'm hoping this is gonna be okay you can guarantee this is a pricey bottle um, I've not looked into how much it is and it doesn't say in the edit but this you're not going to get much change from £100 for this which it's a shame that they just don't work for me I find it really frustrating but let's um, open this bottle and we'll see how it applies to the back of my hand <laughs> and see kind of ooh, what kind of serum it is I don't know if I should have shaken it first. I've just dolloped way too much on my hand. As you can see, it's quite a runny consistency because it's flowing down my hand. Um, I can't really smell. Oh, there's a very light fragrance in there, which isn't too bad. And it seems to be rubbing in quite well. I did pop too much on, like I said. I always do, I always go crazy. <laughs> you should know be me by now. Yeah, that's absorbed quite well. It's feeling a little bit tacky. So bear that in mind, it might feel a bit sick, sticky, but as it's an overnight serum, pop your moisturizer on over the top and it, you know, it'll probably be fine. But I am looking forward to giving it a go, but I'm not holding up much hope. But let's give you a little bit of information about it from the magazine and see what they say. And it says it's an overnight facial serum that helps hydrate the skin and combat the signs of stress and fatigue. So that's cool. So, you know, it will hydrate your skin, make you look and feel more awake. And if you're feeling a bit stressed, just the application of skincare products, taking that time out for yourself is always a good de-stressor anyway. It's formulated to support your skin when it's most susceptible to treatment, which is overnight. So you can get, you know, a load of products on, and just sleep in it and you know it works overnight your skin turns over overnight as well so it's a good way to get your treatments in 
Pink Orchid is an ingredient that improves skin elasticity and plumps out fine lines and wrinkles for a more youthful appearance with regular use. So the hyaluronic acid is the anti-aging product in there. So leave it on overnight, let it all sink in, and then hopefully you'll wake up looking 10 years younger. <laughs> I highly doubt it, but you know. And it says massage a small piece size amount onto the skin every night after cleansing and toning. And like I said, I would pop on my moisturizer over the top of that. So I'm just popping the magazine down. The next item we have is the Beauty Pro Rose Infused Sheet Mask and it has rose chamomile and seaweed and it says it's calming, hydrating, helps revitalize and moisturize. It has an anti-aging formula and it's a biodegradable bamboo sheet mask so that's fantastic. I can pop it in my compost bin. It's water three, you pop it on 15 minutes, it's 100% plant origin and you can travel with it. So there we go. I think I've tried a mask from Beauty Pro before. I think it's either in Glossy Box or look fantastic. We had an avocado one, which it was okay. Yeah, but I'm willing to give this one a go. And there's the back, obviously you've got all your directions here, which is cool. I do love a sheet mask, so I will put this to good use. And we'll see uh, what look fantastic say about it. And it just says it's a botanical based face mask formulated to heal and soothe which is great you know i love a good soothing sheet mask part of beauty pro's plant-based range filled with superfood ingredients that act as anti-inflammatories and min minimize redness now i do have redness on my cheeks here so i'm gonna hopefully try it out and you know if anything that was similar redness down in my face in my view is great it's anti-aging and it's a great for targeted oily blemished skin it's also full of biodegradable so it's great so if you do have blemish prone skin you're suffering with a bit of masky you have acne or you just have hormonal breakouts give it a go it may help and it says remove from the packaging unfold place on freshly cleansed skin using the eye and mouth holes as guides i'm hoping they're not too small I have quite small eyes and some of the masks I've tried recently they are really small <laughs> and if I'm struggling to get them to fit my face oh my goodness what how would somebody else you know have larger eyes and it says um leave on for 15 to 20 minutes remove and massage excess serum into the face and neck always rub in that excess serum and nine times out of ten these sheet masks come with tons of serum in the packet so remove the serum from the packet and maybe depot it and um, use it the next day or rub it in other parts of your body they're always good the next item we have it's i, I do apologize it's either illo or ilo london fluttery light lashes these look cool it says they're reusable for five wears for a fluttery wispy look you've got your glue included and it's for an 18 hour hold and it's latex free and vegan friendly that's fabulous on the back it tells you how to apply and these are light and wispy ones which is cool they do look quite wispy i'm going to pop these in a giveaway just because i i do not apply full slashes um i'm absolutely terrified of gluing my eyelids together <laughs> so yeah and I've tried my hands shake too much and I just can't apply them very well but I'm gonna pop these in a giveaway I've got a little box going with a couple of items in it so far so I'll pop them by and uh, I'll send it out to one of you lucky guys sometime soon and in the magazine it says they are lightweight lashes to give your makeup look a bit of added oomph I like that word oomph. <laughs> with a winged shape to elongate the eyes designed to give fullness while still looking delicate. Yeah, I do like a delicate, soft looking eye. Not that you would notice it today. <laughs> I've been watching RuPaul's Drag Race and I've been inspired. <laughs> they are quick to apply and gentle to remove with glue included for easy use. So that's cool. And there is a top tip here about cutting um, your outer corners and your inner corners and things. So yeah, that's quite cool. So I will look forward to sending them out to somebody. The next item we have is the Ren Evercalm Global Protection Day Cream. 
and here we go I don't think I've tried anything from this brand yet so I'm quite looking forward to this another day cream do we really need another day cream <laughs> but you know it is something new you've got 15 mils in here it would have been nice if it was a little bit bigger but you know hey ho um, let's see how it applies we have another sticky fiddly seal sometimes these drive me crazy yeah especially when you can't get them off with my stubby fingernails but here we go oh it's very thick that's very thick for a day cream yeah it's not running it's not moving it's not budging at all let's see if they have any fragrance oh that does have fragrance that smells like um a bit sort of like a very natural version of Johnson's baby yeah that's what that kind of reminds me of it doesn't feel overly greasy which is good it doesn't feel very silicone-y either so I like that and that's going in quite well yeah I'm quite pleased with that I will give it a go I do have quite a few day creams that I'm trying to work my way through I would have liked a night one <laughs> But let's give you some information it's an overnight facial serum that helps hydrate oh no that's the Avant product scrap that it's a daily moisturizer in which you have a powerful blend of antioxidants and soothing seed oils to calm and nourish your skin there we go we got it right <laughs> it's designed to protect your skin against dehydration and external aggressors to tackle signs of premature aging and it has sesame seed oil carmelia seed oil shea butter orange peel oil and sunflower seed oil so there's a lot of oils in there um i've got kind of combo skin it's dehydrated but it does lean oily so i'm hoping this isn't going to be overly oily on my skin with kind of all those oils in there and it says gently apply onto the face and neck daily after cleansing and until fully absorbed so we give it a go but like i said another kind of day cream hmm not overly pleased with that one this item I'm really intrigued about it's called the glove scrub X exfoliating accessory for soft and kissable lips and it says there's one product inside these tools I really like um, because they always kind of pop something in that I wouldn't necessarily think of purchasing and I think this is a really good idea because you can just pop on your lip balm <laughs> pop your finger glove on and then just go over your lips I like this it's scrubby but it's not that's that's not very abrasive it's not you know hurting my skin so it'd be delicate enough on the lips but we'll be able to remove all those bits of dead skin and kind of you know your liquid lips that kind of get stuck in there so I'm quite pleased about this and I'll give it a go I've not actually used anything like it before so that's cool get to try something very new and it says it's a tool designed to both exfoliate and treat cracked chapped lips and encourage blood circulation for a fuller pout so that's great so you're moving your lips you're getting rid of all the dead skin off and you know you're boosting the blood flow which is cool so your lips will look fuller without fillers expect to see results immediately and it says dampen scrub X with water and gently scrub your lips avoiding too much pressure so you really don't want to go crazy because you will damage your lips and it says follow with your favorite lip balm for juicy kissable lips and it says top tip do not use scrub X for more than once every four days wash scrub X in your washing machine at 40 degrees yes yeah, so you just rewash it and just go again so that's really cool now the next item we have it's an either all and I am a bit disappointed with this because in glossy box last month I got a nails ink um, nail polish and now I have another nails ink nail polish the other item you could have got was a Belle Pierre I think that's a highlighter and eyeshadow which is there which I would have much rather received but you know and now polish is now polish it's a nice color it's called mayfair lane which is cool so posh and let's have a look it's like a nice kind of 
dusky pink. I think the Queen would wear something like this, doesn't she? She wears a colour that's not far off of this. And um, yep, yeah, they are very strong smelling, <laughs> as I found out um, the other day when I painted my toenails blue. Um, it was very strong. And let's give you some information. It says it's a salon quality nail polish to help you get a professional looking manicure and from the comfort of your own home. This natural pale pink color is shiny and highly pigmented, perfect for creating a wide range of nail looks with an easy to use brush for speedy mess free application. It says no streaking, gloss finish, no need for multiple strokes, plumping technology for a smooth imperfection free finish. And it is a good nail polish um, from what I can see how it's going on my toes. They've not chipped, they've not cracked. It, it's still there, it's still intact and the pigmentation is great. It's kind of like a one coat. You can go in um, and you'll get the color you want or if you want to really vamp it up, go in for another coat. So yeah, it is a, it's a good product. It's just a bit disappointing. So what did you think of this month's Look Fantastic box? To be honest with you, I'm a little bit disappointed. You know, I would have much rather have had the highlighter stroke eyeshadow. And, you know, getting another nail polish that's two months in a row. I know it was from a different box, but you know, <clears throat> it would have been nice to have the other item. Another day cream, getting a bit day creamed out now, but I'm looking forward to using the sheet mask. Let me know in the comments below of what you thought of your Look Fantastic box. Yeah, and I am, um, I will see you again soon. Yeah, so I'm just a bit disappointed. <laughs> In the meantime, lovelies, please take care. Bye-bye.